From McGannis Arena, welcome to Boston University Hockey 2023-24. Bernie Corbett, Mark Linehan, back with you for a new season. A little bit of an unusual situation here for the Terriers on the schedule. They've already played two games for real and split them, including a loss last night at UNH. But we'll step back in exhibition play here against the very talented U.S. National Under-18 team. Yep. Tried to march to the slot and ha had it roll away. And now Eisman coming back the other way. He's got a man open for a shot and a goal. Wow. He's able to adjust here. As, uh, back up over the line. Now Eisman with a little opening for the backhand and a goal. Buck stays in though. Plant centers one and a goal. Wow. Quick on it to clear. It was Aiden Celebrini, but not out. It stays in. Plant got a man open and a shot and a goal there. Oh my. How about the delivery there? Over the line. Humphreys for a shot. Terry's got a piece of that. Humphreys centered one. Buck laying lonely and a goal. Wow. And it's turned over now to Plant. Plant for Bednarik. Give it to Eiserman. Look out. Eiserman for a shot attempt there and a goal. Okay, Celebrini off of Macklin to Kaplan. Back to Macklin. Macklin holds. Gives it up to hey. Tuck and a goal. Tic tac and toe and Tuck. And the Terriers are on the board. Right back, Zemer. Shot attempt there and a goal. Zemer on the run. Hagen's bumper. Hagen's gets it back. Uh, far circle. Heiserman's got his hat trick. They're listed alphabetically. They're going to steal now. Quinn Hudson. Say no goal. It got through Kemp. Mentally, I know there was a mindset going into the season. How does your game plan change after this weekend? Uh, I just think we got to get back to um, just getting back to playing the right way. And I guess the good thing is we have a lot of stuff to work on um, this week. So I guess that's a positive. I mean, a, I mean, there'll be a lot of video clips from the last two games on how not to play. So, you know, we'll, we'll start there. You say playing the right way. What does that look like compared to what you saw tonight? It looks like when you come back in your own zone to stop, um, to finish checks, to have your stick on the ice, to, I mean, it, I can go on all night with some of the stuff we're not doing right now. So. Um, it's kind of endless right now. I, mean, I think we're we're getting in our own way right now, our, our group. So you know, we, we got to find a way out of it. I know this is an exhibition game, but still, um, in front of your home crowd, you want to have a better performance than that. I felt like after every whistle, there was another scrum. Can you just talk about the discipline tonight? Yeah, I didn't, it, it, it was. Just one of those, I feel like those games against that team, it's typically, uh, it happens quite a bit, so um, I didn't really think too much about it. Shuffled the lines a lot. I know that's probably not the main thing we're taking away from this, but was there any combination you saw tonight that you liked? Um, I, I mean, I think the talk played pretty well, I thought, with Celebrini and Kaplan. I thought that line had their moments. Um, we had 13 forward dress, so with all the penalties, with the power plays, the lines were mixed up quite a bit. I thought the Stevens, Grimes, Lachance line in the second period uh, put some shifts together in the offensive zone where they grinded a bit, and you know we're going to need some of that. So that, that line, you know, had some good shifts. Um, but other, other than that, there was a lot of different combinations. Take one more. What's your reaction to some of the maybe unnecessary penalties, like when cross checking? Yeah, I, I missed it. Um, I'd have to go back and look at it. So I, I honestly got I didn't. I didn't get a second look at that.